I've given you all of my heart But there's someone who's torn it apart And he's taken just all that I had But if you wanna try to love again Baby, I'll try First of all, thank you so much for joining me as we check out Cheryl Crow with The First Cut is the Deepest and first of all, the scenery in this video is incredibly beautiful. If anybody knows where this was filmed, please put it in the comments because the scenery is just absolutely stunning. From start to finish, the whole scenery is gorgeous. and. Yeah, I love the kind of like the metaphor behind behind this song of something we've all experienced. That first that first heartbreak, that very first one, is one that kind of sticks with you, and you still remember it and how you feel. And there's never a heartbreak like it after that. It's yeah, there's there's always kind of is like that. There was always like that sense of pain, the the uncertainty, will I ever love again type of thing, and like I said, something very very relatable, something everybody can can kind of relate to. But there's a wonderful melody melody to this song as well, very very catchy. It's it's very melodic. Um, I love the kind of just the this just the acoustic guitar. I know there's a lot of other instruments that have, that have, you know kicked in as well when the chorus you know really ramped up, but. I love this kind of whole this whole vibe of the song. It's it's I've got a feeling before this finishes I'm gonna be humming along to this song. And it's one of those that'll kinda of stick with me a little bit. It'll be probably lodged up there for a few days, that's for sure. So I'm keen to get back to it. So I will knock it back a fraction and let's see this one through to the end. I try to love again. Try. Baby, I'll try to love again, but I know oh, First God is the deepest Baby, I know the first God is the deepest and When it comes to being lucky, he's good But I'm sure gonna give you a try Cause if you wanna try to love again Baby, I'll try
Okay, everybody, that was Cheryl Crow with The First Cut is the Deepest, and I think I enjoyed that song the more it went on. It There was a wonderful charm to it. It was just a wonderful melody, great lyrics, simple tune, wonderful scenery in the video. Everything about it was just stunning. It really was. I suspected I might have been humming along at the end of that song, I think, and I'd have to check back, I think I may have started singing a little bit. Uh, not out loud, because nobody wants to hear that, but yeah, it was, yeah, great vocals in that, really great vocals, and it was wonderful that they were able to shine through, even though, like I say, it was, it was the instrumentation, the music was brilliant, her vocals really shone through on that and it was it was wonderful to listen to, every note was just crystal clear, the arrangement was wonderful, kind of a song that like, I think it's going to stick with me, it's going to stick in the head for a few days, I'll, I'll be humming along to that one, no doubt, but one thing that did strike me, like I said, the video is beautiful, absolutely beautiful, but a lot of songs and I think a lot of you will agree with me, a lot of songs now, uh, current music, it's so overproduced, so massively overproduced from from the arrangements of the music to the videos, everything is just over the top, but this was just simple, very, very simple, and it made it so much more effective, and it kind of drew you in, and, you know, you, you were just, you know, very kind of absorbed into the video, and, yeah, really really good song I think like I say it's going to resonate with a lot of people everybody remembers that first heartbreak and everyone still has that that scar and you, you, I don't think you ever get over that you never you, I don't think anybody really ever gets over that first heartbreak and when, when it can happen so you know from being a, a kid a, a young kid I think even then you still you still remember it that that, that first girlfriend or boyfriend and yeah, you, you never get over that. But yeah, wonderful song. And yeah, keen to really dig into Cheryl Crow's uh, music a little bit more. So that is up to you guys. So flood the comments with your favourites. Cannot wait to check out what's next. And if you enjoyed this, do me a massive favour. Hit that like button. And hit the subscribe button. Come on this journey with me. Such a long, long way to go. And it'd be fantastic to have you along. But until then... And until next time, take care. I'll see you soon. Bye for now.